I mean, truly, in those days, New York was its own sovereignty, its own sovereign nation. There was a general sense of the police weren't in control of the city. We were number one in crime. But there were just all, there was just so many crazy people here, you know? Everybody from the prince to the pauper was in the stone's throw of one another. Part of being in New York was that we had that luxury of ignoring the rest of the world. So that when people like Ford said, you know, drop dead to New York, people outside New York and people inside New York understood exactly what, what the sentiment was. You're not part of America. Fuck you. Drop dead. And so we were like, bet. It was just a lot of creativity amidst all of the civic chaos of the city. It was just a time, man, where, you know, people were going for theirs a lot more aggressively. We didn't even know what we were doing. We just did it because it was here. It was in the heart. The less you have, the more creative you're naturally or forced to be if you are creative. If you're trying to, like, create that identity for yourself, that flavor for yourself, that style for yourself. All of these people that were involved in all of this confluence of uh, special events were doing it for only for love and passion. Money wasn't involved. You really could do something. You really felt like you could do anything. You know, you want to be in a band? Start a band. You want to be a painter? All right, you're a painter. You want to be a writer? You want to be a fashion designer? There was this feeling that you can do anything you want. There was all this music and this renaissance happening. We were conceptual artists. We were painters. We were sculptors. We were we were writers, we were filmmakers, we didn't know what we were. Downtown meant something, it was a physical place, but even more than that, it was an idea. I mean, it was just this incredible burst of creativity that, that I don't think since then, there's been anything to match it. Club culture, hip hop culture, dance culture, you talk about all that shit that influences the globe right now, that shit all is here in New York. And guess what? All within a specific time period. Like you could say, what are the odds of all of that stuff happening in one place at one time? Yeah.